Welcome back to the Hot Tip Bets Daily Pick Show here for Sunday, March 10th, the final day of the college basketball regular season. Obviously, already got a bunch of conference tournaments going on, uh, but we do have a couple of non-conference, not non-conference, conference games, regular season games that is left to play today. So we'll jump into that. Got a couple of picks for Sunday's card here. Before we get into that, though, looking back to Saturday, at the moment, we're about halfway through the slate. One and two on the day. Tulsa comes through, gets the win. Villanova fought back. I mean, they were dead early on but somehow um fight back to stay in that game end up losing it columbia did not look great there in the second half and at the moment fresno state not opening up the greatest hopefully we can get a couple of these wins though later on um and at least make it of a salvageable day but as always check the youtube community tab or the link down below to the website to see the full results there for saturday's card and while you're over on the website take a look at all of the computer model picks up there we got college basketball nba nhl ufc and horse racing picks being posted every single day so go take a look at all of those and if you haven't already joined the discord server click that link down in the description as well go join over there you can get my recommended unit size for all of my picks before the games happen and all of the other great stuff over on the discord server and it's a 100% free to join. So if you haven't already joined, click that link, join today, and let's jump into today's show. Now we start out with a regular season American game in this first one. SMU taking on UAB for SMU. Coming to this game is the 74th overall team in the high tip power ranking. UAB the 155th overall team for this SMU squad. I've certainly had some struggles here as of late comparatively to early on in the season. Um, you know, only winning one of their last four games here, but they did get a win over this UAB team earlier in the year, and they are very good on the defensive end of the court, only giving up a 46.3 effective field goal percentage. On the other hand, for UAB, have certainly, you know, had some losses as of late as well, and defensively have just not played nearly as well as this SMU team, giving up a 51.6 effective field goal percentage. Overall, though, both these teams have been fairly evenly matched as far as American play goes. I mean, they're both sitting at 11 and 6 here going into the final game of the season but the model does like smu on the road in this game a 1.5 favorite here coming into this one um, as far as the books go basically the opposite of that we opened at one up to one and a half on the dog side for smu minus 102 on the money line is where we currently sit which i'm actually looking at the money line here for this game you could take that half point hook um and potentially you know win there with the minus 110 but i'm going to take the slightly better odds here minus 102 on the smu side of things a 4.4 percent edge i really like what i've seen out of this smu team their defense is just a step better than uab um and i think they get the win on the road here taking smu uh, minus 102 here in this one now we head to the patriot league tournament for this next game as lehigh takes on boston u for lehigh coming to this game is the 218th overall team in the hot tip power ranking boston u the 258th overall team and Boston U has somehow got hot right at the right time, winning their last five regular season wins and got the win over Navy in the opening round here of the Patriot League tournament. Um, and against this Lehigh team here this season, you know, beat them at home and then went and beat them in overtime on the road. Granted, both those games, a two point win, a three or in a one point win in the other one. So two very close games. there. certainly a BU team. Um, who played some close contests, but defensively, they've been a strong team this season, only giving up a 50 effective field goal percentage on the season. And for Lehigh, while well, they had some success during conference play, finished the regular season with two losses, um, and they have not been nearly as good on the defensive end of the court, giving up a 51.2 effective field goal percentage on the season. And overall, the model does like BU at home in this tournament game, a 2.72 favorite for them entering this one. The odds, though, making them the slight dog at home in this game, minus one, one, um, depending where you look at the odds for this one, but a 5.49% edge towards the BU money line at minus 105, which is where I'm looking at here for this one. I get it. It's extremely hard to beat a team three times, especially when the first two games were as close as they were, but BU being a true home game here in the tournament setting is certainly going to help them. They've been on a tear as of late, and I think they keep it going here in this game. I'm taking Boston University minus 105 here against Lehigh. 